It is not the routine, but the extremes that have the greatest impact on our infrastructure and society. And the need for design which anticipates engineering failure from exposure to extremes has never been more important. At Monash University, we are making significant contributions to engineering for extremes, ranging from natural and human-made unanticipated events to planned actions on a scale not conceived during the original project design and construction. We are pushing the boundaries of engineering by developing models that can predict the outcomes of these extremes so that solutions can be developed to both protect our infrastructure and importantly, prepare our society for the challenges ahead. The world is witnessing more natural events, extreme weather, earthquakes, tsunamis and fires result in extensive human and economic losses every year. At Monash we are developing state-of-the-art models and tools to help predict the spread of fire and flooding using advanced remote sensing data. We are working on advanced models to simulate multi-event scenarios such as earthquake followed by the outbreak of fire. Integrating all of these mechanisms will help us to build more resilient communities through improved structural integrity, advanced warning systems and understanding of human behaviour with implementation through our extensive industry collaboration. We also need to understand how to counteract extremes like terrorism. Structures need to be able to better withstand the intense loads that a terrorist attack could impose. This often means retrofitting existing structures. At Monash, we are simulating such extreme loading scenarios using state-of-the-art testing facilities. This involves a wide range of investigations on structural evolution at micro and macro levels to address various failure modes. These modelling and experimentation results are being used to improve the Australian standards and building codes. They are also leading to the development of innovative structural solutions for new and existing structures. Monash is using biological agents to understand crowd dynamics under emergency and panic situations. This is helping to improve the design of the urban built environment. We are also developing a live transport infrastructure decision support platform that interfaces to a range of data streams, helping to optimise traffic and transport flows. As a result of this research, Monash is involved in the design of public transport strategies for mega sporting, religious and cultural events, including the Olympic Games and the Hajj. Put simply, our mission in civil engineering at Monash is to make infrastructure more resilient to extreme events for the benefit of all society.